Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. I'm here with my very merry wife, Laura. And I'm here with my festive husband, Nathan. <laughs> and it's almost Christmas time. Yay! Merry Christmas, everybody. So we have our sleigh full of fun things to open because we just like opening things and it's the best time of year for that. Sure. We do this every single Christmas and this is the 2021 version. So we have so many things. Um, some we've opened before. Some we haven't and some are old, some are newer and we just figured we just sort of put a lot of things that we just liked opening. Yeah and things we wanted to try opening that maybe we missed throughout this year or previous years. So we should probably get into it because there's just so so much. <laughs> Peapod. So I didn't realise this was at least distributed or manufactured by Moose Toys. Hmm. I didn't know that. So this is the Peapod Babies. What a surprise, baby inside. There's a whole bunch of babies and some accessories. I hope we get someone that's a baby, to be honest. I, I think you'll be okay. Um, this is kind of like a rubbery, Very rubbery. material. And it's mm. just mm. kind of picks up dust really easily. So if you can see that, we, forgive us. Was it supposed to do <clears> that? <throat> Well, yeah, that's how you oh, get yeah. into it, yeah. All right, so there's one capsule. Okay, so it sort of, sort of pops out the bottom. Ooh. We've got some of the little, like, baby baby images. <laughs> little Ooh. little cartoon sort of babies on there. What a weird thing to say. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's actually hard to get the last one out because it's all rubbery. It's sort of sticking. And it's all the way at the top. Okay, so plastic comes off, has a tear strip, and then we squeeze it, and we have... An accessory? I'm not really sure. Uh, we've got a blue duck that the camera doesn't want to focus on. Blue duck? I don't see a blue duck, just a pink duck, so maybe the, all the accessories come in like different colours. Uh, possibly. I uh, have a yellow hat? hat. I think so. So I'm assuming... And that's it. Oh, I'm sorry, I've got a, a piece of paper here which a is... A birth certificate. Peapod baby birth certificate that you can fill out. Oh, that's a that's a big head. Hence the big hat. Uh, what does it say? Please read. Squeeze baby's head to fully form. That's. Don't do that with a real baby. No. Ah, <laughs> oh, okay. I, I think I get what it's trying to do. So it actually is a bit more. It's just sort of flattened in there. To so fit into the little capsule. You want to hold the baby? I'll sure. take a look at the. Uh, it's got a little like hole for its mouth. Uh, what does it's it interesting. say? Interesting. Uh, Daniel, this little man seems to be following in the footsteps of his parents, who are both musicians. He doesn't know any guitar chords yet, but you can tell he knows how to shake his booty to music. He loves French fries and looking at the sky at night. Fair enough. There's his hat. Looks like the Riddler's hat. A little bit. It's got like little circles on it. All right. So this one is the bottle, which I'm assuming, since it's squeezable, you could theoretically feed him. Oh wait, with it? no. Well. Yes, there's a little hole there, so I should. Or not, not really feed him, but like pretend that he's having some milk. All right, we have some booties and like a little like jacket. We're not going to bother putting that on because we've got too many toys to open. And there's a big like safety pin thing, like a he, pretend one. Plastic. Was he rare or not? I don't know. Uh, Are they rare? No. So the rarer, rarer ones are over there. All right. All right. So I think I'm going to go here with something we haven't opened in such a long time. It is Shopkins, well, sorry, not Shopkins, Happy Places. Uh, this is the Wedding Royal Trends. But it's the wedding, wedding, new wedding season. I'm not sure we actually specifically opened up this one. Uh, no. I know we got the Royal Trends because they came with the crowns for the mini packs. Yeah, th this was like right near the end of Happy Places, I think. Maybe yeah. even the very last set. You gotta let us know. Very shiny though. It is very, catches your eye very muchly. Alright, so put a there's a checklist there so you can find out who we have. I think that would be very unlikely. <laughs> Whoa! Ooh, good catch by <laughs> me. Okay, so we have some sort of blue cat with a big bow so and that's tiara. Sweetie paws. Sweetie paws, okay. And then you have cupcake. Which is a little like kitty face. The camera doesn't doesn't seem to like these. Really wants to focus on Santa on the back of our sleigh there. It's because <laughs> the camera keeps picking up his face. Yeah. Um, I actually don't mind this set. There's a whole bunch of cats and bunnies and I like cats and bunnies. Yeah, I don't remember seeing that set. So maybe we... Um, I'm, I'm going to leave yeah. the toy mini brands to you. Thank you. Of course, we have one of the new uh, uh, minifigures, Marvel Studios. Um, we haven't opened up any on this channel. No. So this should be fun. Um, we have opened a couple kind of behind the scenes, so as long as we get someone different and I can see that we haven't. <laughs> you will still build that though to show everyone I will. who we have. 
All right, well, how about I open this since you've kindly left it for me. This is the Zuru 5 Surprise Toy Mini Brands Capsule. Uh, I think this is the like second wave of them. Because it says uh, unbox 40 new toys or something. Well, 100 plus minis, where there was only 60, I think, in the first wave, so. I don't know. Uh, there's videos of both waves up on the channel if you want to see more of these. His hair, it receded off to the floor. Oh dear. And I'm terrible with these hair strips. They just. Sure, they blame, just don't come off. Blame the tear strips. <clears throat> I will. And then our second layer, I can't see the tear strip for, here it is. Alright, so we are still trying to complete our set. So hopefully, hopefully we'll find someone we need today. Unfortunately, I think well, Not we're, someone, something. We're, we're missing a lot of the rares and things, more of the more obscure ones. Of course. <laughs> of course, isn't that always the way? Alright, we have the metal machines play set there with the big croc at the front. I'm still spewing that you can still get so many like the wave one in these. Yeah, that's true. Then we have, is it um, Ren? Yes, Stimpy's the cat. Ren from Ren and Stimpy. And then we have, what is it, uh, Hawk? Um, Falcon. Falcon, I was gonna say Hawkman, but no, that's not. That's the Falcon, not right at all. Definitely one of the nicer ones. And with like a little stand, very dynamic pose. Mm. If we had to get a double, at least it's that one. Okay, we have a uh, um, no. Whammo Hacky no. Sack. No, I don't want to see that. We have a whole bunch of these, which is why Nathan's like, no, not that one. No, not, or the hula hoop. I don't want to see a hula hoop in there. No, that's true. It's probably strip up the same end. Yeah. We have the Nickelodeon Slime, slime Station. Set. The camera really just doesn't want to show any of these. We might have to make some I adjustments. I shall fix it. And the very last one is the X-Shot Reflex 6. Was I can't really recall. Was there any <coughs> Wave 2s there? I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure which was which Wave, but I think we have all of those ones, unfortunately. At least there was another hula hoop. <laughs> it's true. We have uh, Smooshy Mushy Bestie Series 3. This is going back some time now. It is, yes. 2017. Why do we still have this around? Uh, we found these on clearance at uh, Toy World. Oh, we didn't open many of them when they first came out, so we have a little fortune cookie. Oh, a little, little awesome. like thing you can sort of thread there to hang off something. Although I think we found that they broke very easily. Yeah. These little things, but very That's smushy. So squishy. Boring. All right, it's time for some lost kitties. Who's hiding inside? This is how old this is. I remember buying these at Toys R Us, like in person at Toys R Us store before they closed. <laughs> so this is series two. I Let's think we might get a cat. Get into it. Oh, I've got this has like compound in it. <laughs> yeah, do you think the compound's any good since how old it is? Oh, it's not looking. Potentially not. We'll see. We'll see how we go. You're digging through this. I should have brought something over to like clean my hands with just in case this gets a bit messy. All oh right. god. Looks like sand. All right. What's well, kid litter? Let's try and. I was gonna try and kind of squeeze it out. It's not gonna no. work. It's not gonna work. I'm glad we chose to open this near the start. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I was like, yeah, get this open. It looks very soft. Let's see if I can get out our bag. Uh, we do have our stickers, nah, the stickers at the bottom, are, the but I can't, staying in there. can't get them. So this is just like a Play-Doh sort of thing. All right, what have we got? And then inside we have, oh my. It's a cushion. It's a cat hiding in like a curved, curved pillow or curved. Uh, Cushion. <laughs> so it's woke up like this set, um, and I think it's Fwed is how it's trying. Yep, yep. Fwed and what, um... Green, uh... Doesn't say. Oh! I thought that was what the little drops uh, were for. It's no? <laughs> maybe that's like... Uh, possibly, but it, it doesn't say unless it says on the packaging. Alright, you can open something. I am going to wash my hands quickly while you do that. We have World's Smallest Classic Mini Collectible Toys. This is series... You know, I don't know. It's not the first series, so it's got to be after that. They're all the ones you can find. I'm hoping we get the Etch-A-Sketch or the Slinky Dog. Gumby! Yes, Laura's yelling at Gumby. Gumby! Oh. I haven't watched Gumby <clears throat> since I was probably single digit age. Well, yeah, that's <laughs> probably the, you know, recommended age. Oh, it's a barrel of monkeys. Oh, no, not a barrel of monkeys. Would you like to know how I know? It feels like a barrel. <laughs> <laughs> it probably shakes like a barrel of monkeys. That's okay. We don't have any of these. I, I like think. the barrel. Oh, monkeys. I think the only one that we've found in, not this set, but one of the other sets is, um, what are they called? Magic 8-Ball. 
Yeah, little barrel monkeys. Little monkeys. So theoretically, you could actually play that like the yeah. actual original game. That's very cool. Very easy to lose the monkeys, though. I'm not disappointed. <laughs> I, I got that one though. All right. Uh, how about go for the minions? The rise of Gru Splatons. We're going to launch a minion, essentially. We've opened up these before on the channel, and they're actually really good. Yeah. We actually really enjoyed them. These need scissors, though. There's not really a... Tear strip. Well, if no. there was, it'd be very easy to open and get, like, dust and things on them, I imagine. All right. So, we have our little, like, base, base piece. Which you could always connect to other uh, sets and things, which was nice. Mm -hmm. Then there's the backdrop. And where's the splattable minion? We have little stickers, so you got to put those on the these, backdrop. These actually have a, um, they're made of a different material, which makes mm -hmm. them very adhesive. It makes the minions actually stick to it, because the minions themselves aren't particularly sticky. No, they're just like a, a squishy sort of... Uh, Rubber. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. There we go. So this is the minion we have today. He's very, very flat. <laughs> that makes it Here's excellent for launching. Our launcher. Please don't launch him away. Can't even see him, sorry. Come on, launch him. And, oh, <laughs> he went nowhere. There you go, yeah. And they stick really well, provided that he hits that, um... The sticker. The sticker. Yeah. All right. If you missed the sticker, yeah. <laughs> what else have we got? Uh, and I'll leave you the Pikmin Pops. How about Ooh. a Rick and Morty? What is this, like a <clears throat> phone charm or a figure or something? Uh, it's one of the, like, cable... Yeah. The ca cablings. That's it. Um, uh, I don't think we've opened up any of these or anything like this. No, they have a whole bunch of these now. Harry Potter, I think, is yeah, another one. Yeah, the Harry Potter ones. There's a whole bunch of different, like, shows and movies and things. It's Birdman. I have only watched a few Rick and Morty episodes. I don't have time to. But it's this one. And... You can put your cable through it. Yeah, it's a reasonable quality. And, yeah, they've got, like, a little... Sort of lime, sort of there. Or like opening at the back there. You can just see if you kind of pull it open and help keep your cables organised or, you know, make Decorate them a bit more them. decorative. Yep. <clears throat> All right. All right. So you've left the pick pot for me. So I have to, have to open this. So we haven't opened these in so long. It's a season two pick me pop surprise. Who would have thought? What does it smell like? Mm, sweet. <laughs> I used to probably know... The scents a little bit better, but oh. Because when no. <laughs> there was several, several sets after this, I think they ended them like Cheeky Boutique or Cheeky Puffs oh, or one of yeah, those. Yeah, they had Cheeky Puffs and Cheeky Boutique, and they had the Style Series and the I Pick Me Flips and the Bubble Drops. And I have a feeling it's not opening up as well because of the age. Would be my or guess. it's just me. Okay. I, they, these things just don't well, work for me trying, ever. <laughs> I was trying to save face for you, okay? No, no, I'll admit it. Okay, so we have our stand. We'll stand up our lollipop, a checklist for you. And I uh, will close that so it'll actually stand up. Alright. What have we got? What have we got? It's this one. A it looks deer. Like a deer. Yeah, it's got little uh, colourful let's antlers. See, let's see. I actually have its card. So it's Bright the Deer. Who is a rare and should oh, smell like, I think, awesome. bu oh. bubblegum. Blueberry, you mean. No, blueberry. You'll always be uh, dear to me. I was looking at Velvet the Elk. Uh, so who was it again? What? Bright, the deer. Bright. Sorry, yeah. the um, mm. Velvet actually looks really similar. So let me see if I can find Bright the Deer. Bright the Deer. <laughs> mm. It's Bright the Deer. <laughs> uh, I was looking at the double packs. Oh, no. Yeah, so you're indeed correct. It is a common though. Yeah, oh, that's right. It smells great. Compared to some of the odors. And it's so exciting getting to open. A pick me pop. All right. After all this time. Speaking of pick me pops. I just realised you can't actually see the pick me pops. Pocket looks. monsters. It's Pokemon. It's Chilling Rain. It's not the newest set. I think the latest set out at the moment is Fusion Strike. They seem to bring out like ones every single sort of week. Yes. All right. Let's see what we get. <gasps> Something good, hopefully. And if I don't, I'm sure the kids will end up getting it. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure they will. I'm not going to read the names because I'm awful at that. And you also haven't done the whole moving the cards uh, from the back. Yeah. We're only opening one pack. <laughs> there you go. You got a reverse holo rare and a regular non holo rare. Beautiful. Did you even show you all the cards? Oh, no one cares about the end <laughs> cards. You have to see them all. These are the money shot cards right here. I see. <laughs> all right. I am going to try out this little ugly dolls pack. Uh, something else we haven't opened before ever. This is series one. 
it says surprises inside. I One assume figure. so. They're That's actually, about it. I think wherever we pick this up from, they'll, yeah, it's like a, they were clearing oh, out the big dolls of these really cheap as well. There's not much in here. This is like cardboard packaging though, which is always oh, good a to see. Oh, checklist. That's always nice. Alright, looks like I've got maybe some stickers here as well. Or something. Alright, here is my figure. Uh, so you have Jiro? 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 I would say Jiro. He looks like... And then we've got something. like a little kind of comic strip with him. Well, there you go. And on the other side. Huh. And in here, I said stickers, but they that wasn't stickers. It's like an <laughs> invite or something. I'm not entirely sure. It's like a little card thing. Oh, gee, it's going to be tiny. Oh, well, there's writing on it, isn't there? It's paper, so I'd be very careful. So we've got like a little cookie packaging and the thing that fell out is indeed a sticker there you go i oh, must have known go. so you can check noodles yeah you can mark them all off awesome all right what am i opening up next oh. do you want to do one of the big things at the back oh yeah i can't see those on camera anymore so we can't forget them smash crashes i don't recall ever seeing this <clears throat> anywhere i do i don't crash and, the truck and unbox the stuff yep uh, it was you know like smashes and Grocery gang and trash pack and all sorts. All right, uh, series run rusty rigs. Now, can I get into this? Is the question. Oh, I'm sure you can somehow. Apparently, yes. Yes, I can. So here is who was it? Rusty rigs. That's what said it said. For all the checklist in here, hang on. It's actually fairly heavy. The the back of it, like the, the front's quite light. Hang on. May put the checklist right. At the yeah, front. rusty rigs. It's got his name on the. And the number plate at the back. Smash go. crushers. I thought like the, the, the series might have been called Rusty Rigs. Oh, okay. So here's all the checklists. Oh, the checklists, all the things you can get. Oh. Common rare, special edition, metallic and all that. All right. So how about I have a look. So you've got a little blue guy there. I do. <laughs> do you want to show him off? I haven't shown him. Oh, yeah, sort of rubbery little. He looks like he's leaking. Something. It's paint. It's blue paint with... Blue paint. Mm. Well, it's a blue paint thing, leaking green paint. It's toothpaste, actually. Oh. That is toothpaste. A toothpaste ace. Oh, <laughs> I don't God. know why that wasn't coming out very well. Uh, and he is a common from the bathroom brigade. Oh, this one you smash and it goes flying. Oh, all right. I'm not going to do that because I don't want it flying off. I never find it. We again. might lose it. Yeah. So, a little crate comes out. What do we oh, get nice. in the crate? Whoa. Ah, beautiful. My favourite, a toilet. A toilet. Oh, he might be from the bathroom brigade as well, I would guess. Uh, Scotty Potty. Oh, God. <laughs> Who is oh. also a common. And you can reload these um, crates. crates back in so you can eject them again. Yep. Our second one is... Something <sighs> big and red? Something big and red, yes. Could it be an ice box? Uh, like a, a fridge? It looks like a fridge. Yep, that's Icebox Ike from the Backbreakers. Are they all commons, I assume? Yes, they are. Most of the set are commons, actually, aside from the Edgy Electronics, which was special edition, and the um, Barfing Bedroom set. So, mm. there um, you go. All right, what next? All right, well, how about I go here with cool things. Um, Barbie career figurines. There's one minifigure inside because you can be anything. You know, I never found out if Barbie wanted to go party or not. She never gave me the <laughs> correct answer. So there's 16 careers to collect there. These are just little figures by the feels of them. The packaging is very, very light. Oh, yeah. I'm guessing I've yeah. got a hairdresser. She's holding. I've got to say, out of all the dryer. ones we get, we get the stereotypical like hairdresser. Okay. Why couldn't we get like an astronaut or a race car driver? You wanted a race car driver, did you? Was I'm there a race car driver on there? I don't take a look. I didn't have a close look. Uh, let's see. Uh, so this is a very small figure. If you were going to display it, I think you'd probably need to stick it on somehow because I'm not sure that she's uh, going to stand up. There was one where she's making a pizza. Or at least maybe that's not by one of her friends because she's got brunette hair. But still, I want the pizza maker one. Yeah, she doesn't stand up. She's very, very small and her hair is way heavier than her feet. Okay, so here's the thing. We've got uh, Lost Kitties in there mm -hmm. and a Treasure X, yep. both of which either have slime, sand, or both. So okay. I'm not going to open up either of those. I'm going to open up the Rainbow Corns Ooh. Itsy Glitzy Surprise. Yay! 
Pop and Swap Gem Hearts. I think there's a few sets of these now, but this is the first of them we've opened. I think the only rainbow corn we did was one of the big ones when they first came out. Yeah, you could like swap the middle out and take the middle out and it's pretty yeah. cool actually. Alright. So these definitely aren't hatchimals if you're wondering. No, they are definitely not. Did you show the back? It's got kind of oh, yeah. who we might find and they are, yes, very hatchimal like. <laughs> There's a checklist there, I assume. Excellent. Very out. useful, thank you. I'll do my best to find out who we have. Shake, shake, shake. Alright. Ooh, all new sparkly surprises inside. Oh, not glitter. Uh, I mean, they've got glitter in them. Oh. Hopefully they're the sort of glitter that doesn't come off. Alright, alright. We have... Well, a lot of accessories in there. I like the egg. The egg is very nice. That's glitzy too. That looks like a little... Sheep? Yes. Very big eyes. Um... <laughs> Hang on, and it comes with little butterfly wings you can put in the back. Oh, cute. Mm. It's got little, like, gold ears. Oof. Um, I'll put the sheep down there. It also comes with, uh, what I'm assuming is a ring. Does it have a bow with it? Oh, wait, all, wait, wait, wait. All of them have bows on the picture. Wait, so that, there is a bow, but the, and the bow, bow goes oh. on its head, <laughs> not on its back. There we go. Okay. I got there. So I was looking and I was like, all of them have bows in the picture. <laughs> it's making it hard. I was like, oh, that one doesn't have a bow. Um, this is teeny. Yep. Do they have rarities or are they just There's all... two rares in the whole set. The rest are just common. So Gold and silver. Yep. Looks like there's a ring. I'm sure we can put something on the ring. You can. There's... This here that shows you can put like, oh, can like you... maybe the bow or oh, like on, a butterfly on, or hang on. Does this the heart off the front? Hey, because the go. um the bow and the butterfly have different little shape at the back. Does it go on? No, maybe not. Hmm. I'm positive that's what it's saying. Oh yeah, there's a certain yeah, way it goes on. It shows on. the heart on there. Hang on, there. Yay! Cute little yeah. shiny sparkly it's ring. A little bit uh, big for me, and you're a little small, small <laughs> yeah. little hair clip of some sort. Great. What uh, do we have in our other egg? Ooh, it's got a glittery front at the front. Do these eggs stay closed without the? I think yes. so. Boink. Boing. Oh, someone orange. Orange, you glad to see me? What's on her bow? Oh, it's like a, a rat or something, or a tiger. Rat? What's on her bow? A spotty? I think yep. that's diva. I believe. It looks a bit it looks between... kind of like a tiger on the yeah. on the checklist. Well, I've got to say, that looks a bit ratty to me with like, the big nose and the front teeth. I'm not sure I'm, I'm really with that one. And as usual, you've got the little ring, ring and the you can thing. Put the heart on? Yep. I'm not going to. But you can if you want to. Alright, so we actually still have something else oh, no. hiding in the front. We have Series 3 Smushy Mushy Besties. This is the Sweeties. I think the one you opened earlier was the best. Oh, slightly different. Besties yeah. something else. Yeah. Oh, I've got a pineapple. <laughs> Damn, that's one looking fine apple. That is a little pineapple with a green top and a little gold chain to hang off it. Squish, I like them. Squish. I just wish they were a bit more um, robust. Squish. Yeah. Right. It's just the bit where you put the chain, I think, is the main issue. Lost, uh, Lost Kitty uh, Kit Twins. Mm -hmm. Series 2. Series 2. Yep. I, this was like a side set running alongside. Hey, it says Littlest Pet Shop. Is it part of the Littlest Pet Shop range? Oh, I don't know. Someone can maybe let us know. Hmm. Alright. I can't remember. We, we've opened quite a few Lost Kitties on the channel. But there's a few, like, side releases that I think we might have missed. I feel like this is one of them. Is that the checklist? It feels like uh, a book. Yeah, it feels quite thick. I'll open that up for you if you'd like. I mean, that's the checklist I'm assuming oh, we've got there. Well, I'm not sure what I have then here. Alright, so we have two little canisters. I'm assuming full of putty, slime, sand, or all of the They're above. They're not slime, though. They're comp compound, it's called. Yeah. Alright, open, please. Yeah, this is like a little, um, what are they called? Flip book. Uh, you could like flick through the story, but it's kind of curved, so it's not really. No. Nah. Kind of got a little bit of it there, but it's curved, so it's not really um, flicking through <sighs> that well. The hands. You've got a little ice cream scoop. Mm, yep. Looks like a soap bottle or shampoo. Oh, that'll be ice cream topping if you've got an ice cream scoop. And then we have hopefully the little. This had like cats and mice and stuff in it. Yeah. Was it an L set? Yep. 
Well, th this one is probably more double cat, if that makes sense, because it's kit yeah. twins. So... Yellow one, yellow one. Um, there's a few yellow ones. I might need to see the other one to work out which set of twins it is. So maybe bust into that other one. Right, look there. And Put I'll look there. as I go. Oh, I looked. I saw the. I saw the toilet. And I was like, did that come <laughs> out of it? No. Well, it, it, you know, kid litter and all that. Uh, um, oh, I think. I think I found it. I won't say yet. Well, I'll. Because this should match, sure. I assume. Yeah, yeah. They, they're in pairs. They go together. Alright. Yeah. Camera open. Oh, that's very pink. It is. They're Ooh. scoops of ice cream, too. They look like the containers. They do. That's why they had that colour. So we have like a little... Oh, yes. Like a soda. Mm-hmm. And then we have... The I'm... accessories aren't really on the checklist, though. They just... Just in case anyone's wondering. Funsies. Oh. I'm trying to make minimal mess here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if that's going to happen. Oh, we have an ice cream cone. That's flat on top. Which is unusual. Mm. Oh, that just flicked up in my face. That's interesting. Yes, it did. We'll have to find that later. Oh, no. We'll step on it and get stuck in our socks. <laughs> no, don't say that. All right. Oh, that's a big one. Chunky. Yeah. So, see how that's kind of a weird... Uh, has a weird, like, concave in the middle? Yep. You're getting carried. Exactly. So we've Mal. got the greatest and the natest. I don't get it. That's what it is. I believe this is from hashtag Kitty Chaos. Mal. I'm going to go wash my hands. Because it's unfortunately uh, such a stickiness that it doesn't seem to be rubbing off. No. So I've just brushed that out of the way. I'm going to jump into our big pack of Oh My Gift. Gifts Gone Live. Uh, so these are based on like online gifts that have done the rounds. Uh, but they kind of um, move when you kind of click them. Uh, mm, best way to get into this. Uh, I really like these, but um, from everywhere we were seeing, they were on clearance. Because mm. they were fairly expensive at the start, if I recall. When they first came out anyway, what were they like? Yeah. Eight or not? Maybe even ten dollars each? I can't remember. They also, unfortunately, some of them break relatively easily, well, which is, you know, not exactly ideal. We had a few that were broken straight out of the pack. Exactly. Yeah. So did our kids, I think, too. Trying to look the checklist now. I think it must still be in here. All right, all right, all right. Does it say something on the tongue? Hashtag I heart you. Point. <laughs> okay. Here I have a jar of pickles. How about I open the other one and see if there's a checklist in there? Huh? This up. I was like, oh, is it turning? No. You know, there's toys out. Hashtag deal with it. We've seen called caps versus pickles. Yeah. Isn't that unusual that we now have a cat who is? Is related? it a pickle jar? Pickles? Anyway. It's not pickles anymore. Pickles. So let me That's get, cute. I like so that. So we have the love heart and the pickles. Yep. So it's a love sick hearty from okay. the three bit pack. Yep. Of the besties. And you had the pickles. Yep. Le, sure did. The pickles, the pickles. Having trouble finding pickle jar on there. The pickle puggo. Pickle Puggo. Okay. Uh, under the hashtag current vibe. Right. And oh, it's sushi. Laura's got oh, a theme for small foods. I love things that look like sushi. Oh, that's awesome. Alright. So you think it's Oh, really... it's hard here. This is rubbery. And then there's a wheel. Oh, it opens. What on earth? Hang on. Oh my goodness. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm also having a very really hard time wow. finding it. So it opens and closes as you drive it along. Oh my god, that's awesome. Uh, oh, so it's it's on a three bit pack. It is swaggy sushi dude. Hashtag wasapi. Wasap. Wasapi. <laughs> that's not what it says on here. Oh wait, is that an eye? I thought it was an exclamation mark. No, it's oh an my eye. bad. Yep, sorry. And then we have the little cards for them as well. There you go. And then it's got, you could like scan them into the app as well, which we do not have. Oh dear me. All right, our last one, probably our messiest. <sighs> they were very cool. Treasure yes. X, five versus ice. Uh, I don't know what it says, a series three or four or something. Oh, we also had a stand, sorry, in the Oh My Gift Pack, which I assume is for the heart. Well, that makes sense. the base is not flat. Yeah. 
These are all things you can do. Now, I'm going to cheat and try and get into this as fast no, as I can. No, no. This one was different. You're thinking of the wrong thing. Oh, it was just the one that had um, that jelly and all this that. This is the one that erupts. Oh, it depends if you get the fire or ice. Yeah. They were cool. Um, we might get something to put it on, though, so that we don't make a mess on all the other lovely toys that we've just opened in this video. Nothing worse than destroying everything you've got. <laughs> Alright. Ooh. I it's just the, the jelly, not the eruption. We're not getting anything to... How about, I'll go get something, a plate or something, and you keep on opening what? up. Hang on, where were the instructions? You gotta do it in order. We're in a home improvement say. Um, real men don't need no instructions. Well, I'm not a real man, so... <laughs> There's the things that we might find. So instructions, you actually are meant to not open the bottom first. Beautiful. So you've done it in the wrong order already. Everything's coming together nicely. All right, we need some water. I didn't get any water. I have some water. So place on a plate, uh, we've got our tool. Peel off the top of the volcano, and then we want to fill the cup. I think we've left that. <clears throat> left that in our box. It was a little uh, plastic one, wasn't it? A yep. little, just plastic pouring cup. Do you want to hold that? I shall. Look at this beautiful Fill cup. Fill cup with water and pour into the top of the volcano. Do not remove the X key. The X key's inside here. Glug, glug, glug. Stay hydrated, kids. Okay. All right, let's pour it in. Ooh. We've got lava. <gasps> Very cool. It's so little, soft and fluffy. Watch it erupt. And then obviously you see whether you've got lava or ice. I think we got lava last time maybe as well. I thought we had we've done both of them. I don't know if we've done both on camera. Possibly. And then when it's finished erupting, we can get our X key. Boink. Which is there. Now I'm assuming it's turnover. Now after it hang on, it's still it's still going. A little bit. <laughs> I feel like the eruption we had last time was a little bit bigger. Uh, I don't know. Go watch our old video and tell us. <laughs> yeah. All right. Now we turn it upside down and then you can tip that out onto the plate well, after you get all of the quite, plastic off. It didn't open quite right. There we go. I do have scissors if we need them though. Yeah. And also don't eat this. Oh no. This is definitely not food. Whoa. Ooh. You just spread that everywhere. Ah, You're beautiful. still tipping it out. No. <laughs> Nathan! Okay, so now we can use our tool to cut into it. I vote that you do this. Thanks. I need to hold it, it's a bit slippery. Okay. Makes very unpleasant slurping sounds there. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> I'm just going to pull it apart. I think it's going to be a bit easier. This uh, has been a very long video already. You said you were going to do it the right way. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't. Alright, I can already see who I think we have. Wow. Damn, that's an ugly sucker. <laughs> Look at him. He's got some really weird boots with like fins? Those boots were made for walking. You wanna hold? hold you know, for me? maybe you. they're the iron boots from um, oh, no. Ocarina of Time, you know, so we can walk underwater or whatever on strong winds. So I believe we have Hack Draft. So I'm assuming he's got a, some sort of hatchet or something in there. We've got his meteor. Which can have the treasure. And then under here, we've got his weapon. Ugh. I'm glad you're doing There's it. There's one part. This is just like a really thick jelly, by the way, if you haven't seen these opened before. It actually comes off really easily. Like you can see this is clean and I only just got it out of the jelly. So it's got pros and cons. So that's his weapon. Well, you've given me, I think his staff has the treasure that you put on there and his weapon here. Oh, sorry. Recall. My bad. Yeah, two different parts. Uh, we have so, yeah, this is, so this is Hack Draft from the Jurassic Jammers section of the figures in the fire half. And then we use our X key, which, which we took out before. Underneath all the lava. To crack open our very, very sparkly media, which the camera doesn't want to focus on. Here, take that. All right, here we go. Ooh. No real gold, but it does look like a cool one. 
What do we have here? It's a head. Looks like a pineapple. It's like a skull with something on the top. Is it the pit of mm, Bernie Quite Secrets, so. maybe? Huh. Um. Hmm. Oh well. Let's whack it on. I'm trying to check on the checklist, but I think it's the lamp of fear. But it kind of looks a bit different. I'm trying not to touch the checklist with my dirty hands too much. I think it's this one. Yeah, I think it's that one too. Um, Lamp of Fear. It just looks more... Sparkly. Yeah, on the checklist, so... But no, none of the others look anything remotely like it, so... We did not get him last time, so I'm really glad that we got a different one today. Oh, that staff is too long for him to stand up. Let's move this out of the way. And there's our mess. <laughs> oh, boy, there's a lot of clamp to left and right of me. Our mess and everything we opened today. I really like the sushi. I think that's got to be... Gotta be my favourite. What would be my favourite? I like the rusty truck one. You know, I enjoyed crashing it. Yes, I know <laughs> our kids will. Mm -hmm. If you enjoyed watching this video, give us a thumbs up. Uh, we want to wish you a very Merry Christmas, of course, as well. And here's hoping that next year is a good year for everyone. Exactly. So Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and don't forget to subscribe. Sounds good. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.